What's up all my fellow stoners out there? This is to give you the update on the garden out here, the stoner's corner garden. Outdoor we're growing right here. This is uh, Humboldt Seed Company's blueberry cupcake. This is Fino number two. I got one inside and three I'm letting my brother grow. This is a, a pure sativa and you're seeing it come true, just how beautiful she looks. This is the purple haze. This is Mimosa Orange Punch number one. No, this is number three, Fino three. This right here, when we all first started out the strawberry cough, I said, I don't know, man, I just don't know. So I popped the Skywalker Haze. Skywalker Haze didn't make it. And look at pure sativa. Beautiful. Look at that leaf. Look at that leaf. Holy Toledo, man. Right here was one of the replacements for the Granddaddy Purple Gorilla Glue I lost. This is Santa Muerta. Uh, looking good. Starting to take off. She's like two to three weeks behind everybody else. This is the Mimoso Orange Punch number two. Starting to flower. They're autos, so they're starting to flower because I'm running out of weed. So, I need things to go. This is the Mimosa Orange Punch number one. I grew, started her two weeks before, but look at her. She's starting to take off, man. Holy cow. All right, and within those two weeks, we had a freeze. All the other plants seemed to do good except for the... Blackberry Auto by 420 Fast Buds. But oh my gosh, dude. The sun's not shining on her yet, but check out that purple. Holy crap, I wish she would have. Ah, we hit a 31 degrees right after I watered her. And she went into shock. Baby Dur loved on her. She's recovering. So it's pretty good. And right here. Also one that I watered that same night and kind of went into shock. This is the original blueberry. This is the original blueberry by 420 Fast Buds. And pollen's just, everything's just starting to take off. She's starting to look good. She was looking kind of weak in the beginning, like, what's going on with her? But now she's starting to thing, keep hitting her with that Fox Farm bloom, bud and bloom. And... She's starting to go. I'm starting to see her thicken up, which I was getting kind of mad. Always come out and talk to my plants. Always come out, check on them, make sure everything's good. But this is the outdoor garden. I'm in love with this strawberry cough. Oh my goodness. That's just so beautiful, man. Anyway. This is the outdoor. We'll go check out the two plants indoors, which will be black cherry soda and uh, pheno number one, I think. Of, no, that's pheno number, yeah, number one inside of a blueberry cupcake. Damn, never smoke before you do a video, man. Anyway, this is the garden outdoors. We'll go check out that garden indoors. Okay, welcome to the inside. Blueberry cupcake number one and black cherry soda. As we remember, black cherry soda was kind of small. What I'm going to do is they're getting to be around day 51. And Homegrow TV flipped his over to flower at day 51. So what I'm going to do is wait till black cherry soda gets into each one of the holes. That way we can open her up and let the other ones come through. And then I'm gonna flip it to 12-12. And we're gonna go into the first day of flower that day. Tonight they get watered because I water them when they wake up. These two plants are on a flip cycle, which means they go to sleep at 11 a.m. and wake up at 6 p.m because my shift would keep me away from the plants and when I get home, I wouldn't be able to 
tend to them, work on them, make sure everything is going okay with them because it'll be dark and I ain't herming these things. So that's what we're going on here. Of course, this is the AC Infinity 2x4. Give a shout out to the homie Ohio Grow Ops. Don't even check them out. Go check out his channel, his Facebook page. I'll be on that all the time. But this is the Stoner's Corner 2x4. Anyway, in two weeks, I'll see y'all then. And y'all do what you do best and burn one. And remember, slow and steady wins the race, baby.